Hello everyone, welcome to Cross Cultural. Today we're going to watch together this video called the Unusual Method Used by Sushutra. So I'm very curious. I'm looking forward to watch it because he's a historical surgeon, so we'll learn a lot of things. We have. I'm sure you must have known him as an ancient plastic surgeon. It's sad to see him reduced to this. There is much more to Sushruta than just being a plastic surgeon. Imagine thousands of years ago when the world of medicine never even thought about doing switches. This man sitting in Kasi figured out how body anatomy works, invented multiple surgical equipments and saved the lives of thousands of people. Don't you think he deserves to be known much more than just a plastic surgeon? What are the techniques he used? How did he figure that let's see everything in detail well i think uh, that he used uh, ancient uh, techniques that uh, nowadays uh, medicine and surgeon will use Approximately 2,600 years ago, the Punya Bumikashi witnessed a man who was about to change the world of medicine forever. What made him do so? What inspired him to realize the? So we have to say thank you to him, probably importance of surgery. It was a time when wars and bloodshed were a common thing. While seeing the injured soldiers, he found his inspiration. Modern doctors would practice the incision on dead bodies, just like that Shushruta used the dead bodies to analyze the anatomy of the human body. He would keep the dead body in water and let it decompose. And as time passed, he would dissect and study the structure of the human bodies layer by layer. He emphasized that a surgeon should learn not only from books, but also from practical experience. As per the needs, he himself designed 121 surgical equipments based on the shapes of bird peaks and animal jaws. Some I think that uh, are very, very precise tools he used. Some of his tools were so precise that they yeah. could dissect a single strand of hair. And he divided the surgical procedure into three stages. Number one, pre-operative preparation. Number two, the operation itself. And number three, post-operative care. This included preparing the patient, the tools and even surgical room. The patients were advised to be on fasting or on a light food diet. Alcohol was used for pain relief. And even anesthesia, antiseptic and sterile procedures were used by Sushruta. He also described 14 types of bandages and stress the importance of cleaning the wound before switching to prevent infections. Look how system... Yeah, I think that now is a very easy going thing, but 2,600 years ago, maybe not. So thank you, Sashutra, because uh, you have also to... Yeah. Article was done. This is the culture which has been talking about the best way to sit, the best way to eat, and even the best way to breathe. Look at where we are today. Everybody is suffering from some kind of disease. One in five Indian women suffers from PZ body. Approximately 1,78,000 new cases are being diagnosed with breast cancer every single year. Almost everyone over 40 years has diabetes now. Even youngsters, fit and healthy people are dying of heart attacks. And the medical inflation is 14% which is so damn high. We are literally living one medical bill away from going bankrupt. That's why it's a sensible idea to car ourselves and our family with a health insurance. Policy Bazaar offers health insurance with up to 25% discount starting at just 390 rupees a month. And for most of the policies, no medicals are required. And you can get tax benefits up to 75,000 under Section 80D. Even your existing policies can be renewed with a new insurer. It has health policy for every sort of person like C senior citizens, people with pre-existing diseases like diabetic patients, everyone can be covered. And it's important to have individual health plan even if you have corporate health insurance as an employee, as corporate policies can be... Okay, I think that uh, in some countries, sanity is private and other not, but um, I'm very grateful because uh, here uh, sanity is public, so yeah, you have to wait a lot of years, so... Mm, is not good sometimes because you pay for having a visit in advance so you pay in any way but um, i don't know if today i have an idea i go to hospital i don't have to pay nothing so i'm very grateful because i think that these are a good thing and in other country i know that is a everything is private so i think that it should be free for everyone because uh, um, is a direct 
cancelled when you change companies or even when you retire. And Policy Bazaar supports the customer at the time of their claim. They'll reach out to you within 30 minutes of contacting them. If the customer faces any kind of challenge at the time of claim, Policy Bazaar representative will visit the customer at the hospital and resolve the challenges. And NRAs living in foreign countries should consider purchasing a health policy for your parents. Policy Bazaar offers a dedicated team for claim support, providing assistance within 30 minutes so that your family doesn't have any trouble. If you think this is something suitable for you, do check out the link in the description. Do you remember the story of Supanaka from Ramayana? When her nose was cut off by Lakshmana, King Ravana later had a surgeon reconstruct her nose. We all ignored it as mythology. But Shushruta in his book Shushruta Samhita describes a technique that's now named as plastic surgery. Mm. The only difference is he did not use any plastic for that. Instead, he used a live flesh from cheek, abdomen, forehead and thighs. He clearly explained Whoa. how to repair nose and ear lobes using the nearby skin. In England, the first article on rhinoplasty appeared in 17 when a British yeah. surgeon Carly Leon Lucas wrote about it. Even he mentioned that this method is already known in India and unfamiliar to the British. After the third anglo oh, So, so, uh, so Shutra invented rhinoplastic. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Because I think that a lot of people should be thankful to him. In 1792, Tipper Sultan did a mass nasal mutilation to the British Army soldiers. One Bartin Bullock driver employed by the British was also mutilated in that. A year after this incident, a porter reconstructed his nose using the skin from the forehead and it was all recorded by the British. And we keep saying the British educated us. Education doesn't mean holding a degree certificate. An educated person should be a skilled one. I think we Bartians were pretty good at it before the arrival of British. So plastic surgery, particularly rhinoplasty, has a long history in India and Sushruta explained the wow. detailed procedure for this. Amazing. He also described a form of catch-up surgery where a curved needle is used to push the catch-up aside and then the patient's eye will be sprinkled with breast milk. Wow, he's a, a genius of medicine, I think. He's a, something like a goddess of medicine. So, wow, I think that a uh, lot of uh, things that uh, nowadays are used he invented or discovered so well for example i didn't know that rhinoplastic is uh, invented and you know um improved by him and let's remember the practice of kachak surgery was introduced to china only from india as per the chinese records shishruta used quite a few unusual but effective methods for surgical procedure for example in cases when there was a blockage in the intestine he suggested bringing two ends of the intestines together using black large ants to intestines were gently put back in place and stitched up while this may sound cruel to us it was an effective method back at that time oh. not just ants he all uh, seems like painful treatment also used leeches to treat conditions like boils tumors and similar diseases leeches were particularly used when surgery yeah. was not an option he described what kind of leeches to use and explained everything in detail according to shushruta there were 12 types of leeches but he recommended using only six of them for medical purposes he even oh i didn't know this thing i don't know if nowadays um, people medician surgeon use the leeches but oh, it seems, seems amazing. Explain how to catch the leech, where to place them and how to feed them. Everything is explained in detail. And would you believe if I say even in modern medicine, leeches are used for certain medical procedures. The food... Okay, and <laughs> they use... Drug administration in the US has approved the use of leeches as a medical device for specific medical conditions. In a study conducted in Germany, leech therapy was found to be beneficial for patients with long term knee pain. Shushruta recorded all his knowledge in detail in a form of Sanskrit text called Shushruta Samhita. Wow. You can use also leeches for um, uh, calm the pain of a uh, knee, etc. Wow one of the three major pillars of Ayurveda. Not just plastic surgery, he did brain surgery, urinary stone removal, cesarean, tumor oh. removal, intestine blockage removal, amputation, and the list goes on. Wow, he's a genius, like I said before, so he did a lot of surgery thing. Wow. Approximately, he invented 300 surgeries. Imagine some oh two... God. He invented, I think, half of the surgery thing. Wow, wow, it's amazing. Great. Congrats.
2600 years ago this man invented his own tools analyzed the body anatomy by himself learned the art of doing surgery and taught them to hundreds of people medical communities all around the world recognize him as a father of surgery his time period 600 BCE is considered the golden age of surgery his statue is being installed in the Australian College of Surgeons but how many of our kids are being taught about him okay so uh wow amazing i didn't know him honestly um sorry <laughs> but i think that he's like a godness of surgery he invented the uh, 300 types oh, and wow well, congrats and yeah 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 i like this video and i hope you like too please comment like and subscribe bye